My camera is always dirty. This is not a good intro. I need to put in a little more effort than that. Okay, you know what's weird? It's the second semester of my sophomore year in college and I've never done a college week in my life. Like, am I really in college if I haven't done a college week in my life? Like, no, basically not. But it's currently Saturday when I'm starting this video and this upcoming week, I'm gonna film a college week in my life. So I'm really hoping you guys like this. I guess I will see you on Monday, bye. Happy Monday. So I'm in the art building right now. There should be someone like around the corner. That literally would happen to me. I just said Spanish class, but now I have printmaking, so I'm going to that. So I'm required to take it for my art minor, which I'm doing for like video stuff. But so far printmaking has been kind of a struggle, but we're getting through it. But yeah, I'm gonna... I thought someone was going around the corner. But yeah, I'm gonna go to class and maybe I'll show you a little bit of my printmaking. Let's go. This is kind of cute. What other people in my art class make versus what I make, honestly. <laughs> So I finished class and low-key cut my finger. The class is two hours long and I literally spent two hours carving one block. I'm not the best at it, if we're gonna be honest, but it was an attempt. I'm gonna go get some food because I'm very hungry and maybe coffee. I literally, okay, I got Starbucks before my Spanish class. Now I might go back. And then I need to do laundry, which is my favorite ever. I just pushed back doing laundry way too late. Like, I have no more socks. I have one pair of underwear left. Who let me live on my own? I got some Caesar salad, which looks really good. And then I got an iced vanilla latte. What's new, honestly? I love vlogging in public. Literally my favorite thing ever. So many cars keep driving past. It's funny, like, I know all the places on campus where people don't really come and I can film. So I'm by like the basketball stadium or like not stadium, I don't know anything. The basketball gym. Basically I have to take a photo for Princess Polly. You guys are gonna see how I take my own photos. It's like way easier if I have someone else to do it. But today I don't have a photographer. I really hope no one comes around the corner. I'm doing it for you guys, honestly. Someone just walked up behind me while I was vlogging. I'm already cringing. <laughs> it's fine, I'm fine. One of those better be cute. I actually think I got one that's pretty good, but I'm gonna try another location too. We wanna be sure. She's walking back again. Is any of this cute? I just need one more. That is all we need. I don't know. Okay, it's actually like really hot out. So I have no idea why I brought this huge coat, but... <laughs> so it's currently 3.30. Then at 4.30, I'm meeting a girl from Delta Gamma for coffee. I just joined DG a few weeks ago, actually. We do second semester recruitment, and I've been going on like a ton of coffee dates. I kind of have a caffeine problem. Whatever, it's fine. I'm fine. Might be going blind, but besides that, I'm fine. <laughs> I got some mac and cheese and an Asian sesame chicken salad. A solid meal, you know? This lighting is actually so bad. Hey, how can I fix it? Wait, do you think I can actually... Okay, kind of ugly. How can I make it more... Wait, did that work? Is this still really ugly? Basically, we don't have like sorority houses, but we have sorority cottages. So pretty much just like a sorority house, but no one lives there because like it's tiny. It's pretty much like one room. And since it's a new member, period we get like fake bigs and a few times during the week she leaves me gifts in the cottage so right now i'm here to pick one up okay guys we really got the goods this whole kroger bag is like full of like shirts a bunch of food like a fanny pack but i have to meet my marketing group in under 10 minutes so i know i'm putting my seatbelt on so i'll show you tomorrow the whole haul okay see you tomorrow probably What do you wear when it's like 54 and then 70? 
Hey guys, so it's actually two o'clock right now. My vlogging is just not great. I don't know how people daily vlog, especially like if you're in school or college or anything, like how do you daily vlog? So I'm clearly bad at it. But I just finished my second class. I had marketing at 10.30. Then from 12 to two, I had my video class, which has been really fun. I'm making a video about thrifting, which like I know what's new, but now I am finally back in my room literally for like 10 minutes. And then I'm meeting another girl from DG for coffee. That's just like my life now. I just get coffee with people, but like I really like it. Then, wait, I said I'm done with class. I'm literally not done with class. At 4.30, I have a Spanish class. So the way my Spanish works, we have like normal classes, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. And Tuesday, Thursday, we have a Spanish drill. All we do is speak Spanish. So there's no like written part, but it's like kind of scary because this girl will like randomly point at us and ask questions and we have to answer quickly. Last Thursday in drill, I like completely embarrassed myself. She called on me, asked me a question and I had like no idea what she was asking. So she moved on to another guy then came back to me and I still didn't know what she was saying and literally like as I was walking out of the class I overheard this guy talking about how he felt bad for me kind of want to die kind of don't want to go back but yeah I have that and then I have a Spanish test tomorrow so I have to study and then tonight I have a DG new member meeting and apparently we're getting more gifts tonight I'll show you guys what I got wait do I have time I don't want to be late 203 I'll really quickly show you what I got first thing we have a Delta Gamma shirt but it's just like a comfort color sweatshirt this is the back this is from 2008 just like crazy I know Kelsey got some from like the 90s which is really weird next is join forces with Delta Gamma then okay this one's my favorite actually this is an ACDG shirt and this is from a social I think that's really cute and like I'll definitely wear it then I got like a bunch of other random stuff so I got a fanny pack oh wait we have some beads inside always the life of the party and I got a sticker so I'm really excited to maybe put it on my laptop. I don't know. I like that a lot. I have this um, Delta Gamma mailbox. A styrofoam cup. Oh wait, this is really cute. A Love DG like martini glass. And I got some food. So I told her I like Cheez-Its and Sour Patch. I also got chocolate covered pretzels, but I already ate them last night. So they're over there. But yeah, that is my haul. What time is it? Okay, it's 2.09, so I really gotta go. But I will come back and update the vlog soon. Someone needs to stop me, but it's fine, I guess. Since it's so nice, I might go outside and study Spanish. Now I have class, let's go. the fakest shot of all time. Okay, we are back in the car. The lighting continues to be just like amazing, but I'm here for my new member meeting and I don't know what we're doing. I think they're like telling us about DG, like telling us about paying our dues. I already paid and now I'm broke. No, I'm kidding. But Spanish class actually went kind of well. Like I didn't embarrass myself at all. So like that's really well for me, but I still really need to study for my test. So that will happen after the meeting. Let's go. Let me whip out the flashlight since that worked last time. Pretty much I just got, maybe I'll like show you later when I have better lighting. Got some more shirts, like tank tops. I got a few shirts like this, just like letter shirts. Yeah, I'm trying to use, that is really scary. Probably just gonna get food and then study Spanish since that's my life now. The test actually went pretty well. I'm like kind of sweating right now because it is hot out. Sorry, I'm like so out of breath. I just like felt my heart, it's literally racing. Spanish takes so much out of me and also like walking up the hill to get to this class. But yeah, um, I have obviously printmaking and then I have a marketing test tomorrow, so. I will be cramming, studying for that. Okay, I wanna really quickly show you how pretty this building is, but I kinda don't want anyone to see me, so I'm gonna try and make this like low key.
So I'm in the courtyard of the music library, which is like so funny because I didn't know this existed until this semester. It's like a full library that I didn't know was here. I think people can maybe see me through those windows, but honestly, if they're gonna judge, they're gonna judge. Oh, I didn't tell you guys. So yesterday I made the decision to delete Instagram and honestly, it was like a very good move. So I normally have Instagram in this bottom row, like next to Twitter. And since I've deleted it, I've hit the spot where it used to be like absentmindedly trying to open it. I was like looking at this girl's page who I literally don't know at all and was feeling bad about myself. And that's when I was like, you know what? Like Instagram, she has to go. The moment it's not fun anymore and you're like comparing yourself or feeling bad about yourself, that is when you should delete it, even just like for a little bit. So yeah, that is about it. I heard a bunch of people walk into the music library, which means they walked past that window and saw me, but it's fine. Okay, it's 11.50, so I'm gonna actually like go in my class now. And then I will be back once I'm done with class. Okay, I finished printmaking. It's really hot outside, which is like the weirdest ever. But I'm gonna eat my goldfish. I'm gonna try and study marketing. Also really need to powder myself. I actually ran out of face powder. I just like go to the bathroom and use like a paper towel. So life hack for all of you. I know I don't make life hack videos anymore, but we still gotta add some life hacks in every once in a while. Okay, I felt like I had to come in and kind of like explain what happened. I studied, then I went to hang out with three girls in DG. I know I need to vlog people more. People always want to be in my videos, but I'm like weird with it. Wish like I shouldn't be. I just like I get nervous. I don't know. Anyway, sorry. That's like a tangent. But we went to go get dinner at the restaurant on campus. And one of the girls working there is in DG. We have a thing that's like, why DG Wednesday? Which is like what we post on social media and whatever. And so she literally gave me a brownie that said that in caramel. And it was super cute and just like made my day. So yeah, that's what happened. Okay, let's keep going. Update, my life is just a mess. It's kind of in shambles. No, I'm kidding. So right now I have a review session for my marketing test tomorrow. In an hour, I have a meeting for our campus magazine. So it's just kind of a lot. I have my marketing test in 45 minutes, so I'm gonna go review and I really hope it goes well. Okay, I just finished my test and it was pretty easy, so that's really good. We love an easy test. Cause like in college, that's really hard to come by, honestly. So I just have my video class and I just got food. I will show you. I got coffee. Literally don't come for me, please. These, these are my new thing. It's a vanilla latte, but it's weird because it's kind of like, I don't want to say carbonated because it's not like carbonated, but if you shake it and then open, it'll explode. I know from experience. I got a chicken and bacon sandwich. I love these, they're actually so good. I'm gonna eat, I'm gonna chill. This week has been like no chill for me. Cracking open a cold one. I can't with one finger, that's really not happening. I told you. What do I do? <laughs> I love being a mess. That's basically my brand at this point. Okay, should I get more coffee? And I know you guys are probably like, no, you obviously shouldn't. But I have the speaking part of my Spanish test in 40 minutes. I don't know, I think it'll be fine, but I might wanna get coffee. Let's go, wish me luck. I just picked up my gifts from the cottage and I'm like kind of afraid this bag's gonna break. Really hope that doesn't happen, but it's like completely full. <laughs> okay, the talk was so cool. He's the guy, if you've seen on Instagram, like the Neon Lights America thing. So it was like really cool hearing him talk. Then I went to the cottage and got more gifts. Let's see what I got. I haven't really looked. More shirts. I know I got some letters that are somewhere in here. Oh, a bag? That's really cute. Here we go. Here's the G, but there is a D that goes with that. Just finished. I'm done with Spanish, so now it's officially the weekend. So, in a little bit, I'm meeting someone for coffee, then I'm meeting someone else for lunch. Then tonight, I think I'm doing something with my pledge class.
Hey, do you want to be in the video? Hello. Hello. You know, I haven't been in one of your videos since 2015. You were in my... Smoothie my... challenge. Mm-hmm. Expectations versus reality. Oh my Where gosh. I look like a fetus. All like, three of us are like here. two years old. I know. I was watching that video today. I don't know why. But I was like, oh, I wonder like, <laughs> I wonder what ever happened to that video. And I was like, um, we look like we're five. Yeah. Hey everyone. what I did but apparently I'm not in your videos anymore so literally no one is ever in my videos <laughs> Tea it's kind of true. My week in my life is like me. It's because I'm really worried that I'll like make people be in them and they won't want to be in it. It's not like you know, logical. I feel like Ryan is hogging the spotlight. Ryan, if you're watching, you need to move over. <laughs> Thank you. He's not in my week in my life. You are. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> With your one bun. Dude, I'm trying to straighten my hair. <laughs> So that's it for my vlog. Hopefully you enjoyed. If you're not already, follow me on Instagram and Twitter. If anyone's even watching this part, it's probably like one person at this point. Comment down below telling me that you are watching and that you are a true... What's my fan name? I don't think I have one. I think I used to have, when I was like Be With Em Marie, people were like, call your fans like the Em Marieers. If you're a true Em Marie, -er. <laughs> so, so stupid. Comment down below letting me know and I will see you guys in my next vid. Bye!